And a warm welcome on what is a fine day for football. I'm delighted to be able to report. I'm Derek Ray, and delighted to have Stuart Robson sharing commentary duties with me and getting ready for what should be potentially thrilling action here. It is Köln against Paris Saint-Germain. Well, thanks, Derek, as always. The scene is set, two good teams, a great playing surface and a vibrant atmosphere. It has all the ingredients for a really exciting game. And he's broken free. Well, without running to book too fine a point on it, that goes down as a tame effort and easy for the keeper. Louis Costa. Can they create something from here? And a goal here! Well, it took a definite nick and nothing the keeper could do about it whatsoever. Well, let's take another look. And there's the deflection. And from that moment on, the keeper had no chance, did he? So the ball rolling again with the scoreline standing at 1-0. Just failing to hit the target with his pass. And it'll be a throw-in. Nesta on the ball Alessandro Nesta Rui Costa Rudy Fuller Socrates Salah and the danger still on well ruled to have taken up an illegal position only just Just the clearance that was called for. Using all his defensive acumen to cut it out. Kevin De Bruyne. Oh, nice ball over the top. And he's in. And it's a goal for Paris Saint-Germain to square this game. Well, I have to say, this is a really good goal. Just watch his technique here. He just hits through the back of the ball with such power. There's no stopping that. So, a level contest. 1-1. One, one. Take some progress with the ball at his feet. Well, it was straight up the keeper, but technically good goalkeeping. Harry Kane. Useful looking position, you've got to say. And it's two for him today. A masterful performance. The defenders unable to stop him. Well, here's the replay, and it all starts with the delivery into the box. Just begging someone to get on the end of it. And then what a great finish as well. Good connection with the ball, leaving the keeper with little chance. It's a great goal. Well, 2-1 it is here. Socrates. Well, they get themselves level here. Making sure nothing untoward happened. Superb tackle. Well, the managers will now deliver their half-time team talks. We're at the end of 45 minutes in this game. Three changes in one go here for PSG. Well, they get the ball rolling again. Paris Saint-Germain with the advantage but no room for complacency. Making progress. He has teammates around him. Well, he failed to get it away properly. Ronaldinho went in strongly, decisively. Well, goal kick, just as it was looking promising. Donovan. Jude Bellingham. Zlatan Ibrahimovic. Neymar. Making sure nothing came of it. Mbappe. 
Mo Salah. Kylian Mbappe. Just the clearance that was needed. Now we're inside the final 10 minutes in this one. Cristiano Ronaldo. And he has options available. A very timely interception. And that will be all three points for PSG. That's the good news for their fans around the world. Your assessment? Well, Derek, it was a tight game. Both sides had their moments and chances, but overall, they just about shaded it. A well-earned victory. I think it's absolutely ideal. I'm your match commentator, Derek Ray, and sitting alongside me, the former Arsenal, West Ham and Coventry midfield player, Stuart Robson. And everyone here on tenterhooks, you'd have to say, with good reason. It's Paris Saint-Germain against Paris Saint-Germain. Well, Derek, when looking forward to this game, you can't help but notice there are some great matchups all over the pitch, particularly in those central areas. Whichever team wins more of those battles will win the game. Clears it away. Beautiful pass. Ibrahimovic. The outcome is a goal kick here. And that's an important intervention. Neymar. Well, mopping up defensively. Mbappe, Pele, and out for a throw-in, just misfiring with the pass. And Bellingham, well that's a really good authoritative tackle, throw-in here. Well, here it is again. He's alive to the situation. He makes good contact with the ball, and he keeps it down. That's a nice-headed goal. So PSG restart the game. Can they come up with the right answer? A oh, tremendous vision. Well, the threat was very real. Marvellous defending. Oh, big chance. It has to be, surely. And a goal! They've increased their lead, and they don't want to be throwing it away from here. Well, this is a brilliant strike, as you can see. He hits it with so much power, the keeper had no chance. Fantastic finish. So the ball rolling again. 2-0 the score. Young, pressing high to win the ball. Throw in here for PSG. And Messi with teammates to play it to. Mbappe. There it is! A goal to reduce the arrears and give them hope that they can turn this round. Well, I have to say, this is a really good goal. Just watch his technique here. He just hits through the back of the ball with such power. There's no stopping that. Three changes in one go here for PSG. And there it is, the half-time whistle. Well, the ball is rolling again, and Villa. So back underway here, and the big question from a PSG point of view, can they battle back? Neymar, and a chance to level it! And he clears the danger. Milner, this could be the equaliser, and pushed onto the woodwork. And really tried to blast that one past the keeper, but his radar was a bit off. PSG are going to switch things around on the personnel front. And he ran it well. And teammates around him. 
Messi. No problems grabbing hold of that one. And put from long distance. Not the easiest of situations for the keeper. In position. Well, there it is. Real resilience for you, having been two goals down. Well, as we see it again, he was never going to miss that, was he? That's a really simple finish in the end. Goal. So underway again at 2 all. Jude Bellingham. And they find a gap in the defence. Trying to really get at the opposition here. Possession and patience, the watchwords. And PSG will have a throw in. Substitution it is for PSG. Donovan. Now with Messi. No nonsense clearance. Virgil van Dijk. Bellingham. Progressive football from Paris Saint-Germain. They know a goal at this late stage might be decisive. And he has options available. Must take the lead here. And a fantastic diving save. And maybe a chance for PSG now from this corner. What a genuine opportunity, but it was squandered. Go kick. Salazar, and with that, the referee brings this contest to an end. All square here in what was a thoroughly compelling game. Stuart, your analysis. Well, it could have gone either way. I thought both teams were very positive, though, going hammer and tongs from the very... These are just what you hope for as a spectator. A warm welcome. My name is Derek Ray, and sitting alongside me in the commentary position is the former Arsenal and West Ham midfield player, Stuart Robson. And with the atmosphere really building up nicely, we should be in for a terrific contest. It's Real Madrid against Paris Saint-Germain. Well, Derek, when looking forward to this game, you can't help but notice there are some great matchups all over the pitch, particularly in those central areas. Whichever team wins more of those battles will win the game. Really well played pass. Great strong tackle, throw in forthcoming. A really intense pressure applied. Opportunity it is. He had to react and did. Not a touch off the defender last of all, so a corner. And just wide with the header. Saeed al Oairan. Can he do it from miles out? My goodness, that save. What a stretch he was. One for his own highlights reel. And unfortunately for him, he had worked his way into an offside position. And I think everybody in the ground could see that was always going to be offside. Neymar into the advanced position but they dealt with the threat posed and a tidy ball and he's broken free surely still a chance Ronaldinho and reading it absolutely superbly Chance here. In it goes. The opening goal in this contest. Well, as you can see, he hits this with so much power. But just look at the follow-through. So athletic. That's a dynamic strike. Goal. 
underway once more. It's going to be interesting to see whether or not PSG can articulate an appropriate reply. This could be the equaliser. And there the attack ends for now. Jude Bellingham. Eder Militao. And the whistle is sounded for half time in this game. Three changes in one go here for PSG. And the ball is moving again, and work to do for Paris Saint Germain in the second half. Happy to pass the ball, but remaining patient. Nesta. Kukchu. And that's great work to make sure it didn't go over the line. Raul Bellanova. Miguel Almiron. And Real's creative tendencies coming to the fore. Oh, commanding goalkeeping. Well, here's the replay, and what a well-delivered cross this is. Perfectly placed, and it ends up with a fairly simple finish. Certainly not much the goalkeeper can do about that. So back on the way, with the lead standing at 2-0. Donovan. Here's Ibrahimovic, and they could get one back here, and turn it onto the woodwork. Enzo Fernandez, Roberto Firmino, and moving the ball nicely, Neymar, and there it is, another goal, and surely there's no way back from this now. Well, here it is again, and it was never really in doubt, was it? He was always going to score from there. Three goals without reply. Number 11, Neymar Jr. Messi. He had Messi on a shot from miles out. Corner awarded. Well, the danger is still there. Messi, and Messi! Well, flinging himself at it. And the opportunity goes a begging. He decided to hit that with power rather than going for placement. Roberto Firmino. And the referee says, enough is enough, that's the end of the game. It's a defeat for PSG, your assessment. Oh dear Derek, that was a worrying display.